Come on, Sapel. Uh, Il Sapel Pluto? No. Il Sapel Clifford? Ben? No. Il Sapel Snoopy. Il Sapel Snoopy. We are. Uh, oh, Jam Snoopy. Jam Snoopy. Ah, oh, Jam Snoopy. Yay, Snoopy. And our Snoopy doo, 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 in his typical Snoopy fashion, right? <laughs> and he says, Merci pour la danse. So, what's merci mean? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, what's thank he? You. Thank you. And now you haven't had la danse before, right? You haven't had la danse before. But is it the same word in English? Is it a cognate? We, so what is Snoopy saying here? Thank you, Thank you for the dance. Thanks for the dance. How many of you have a dog? So, Charlie Brown, ah, un chien, il s'appelle Snoopy. Oh, madame, a un chien, madame a un chien, elle s'appelle Dala. Oh, c'est mon chien, c'est mon chien. Elle est, elle est petite, elle est petite. Ça, c'est mon chien. Et toi, et toi, tu as un chien? Un chat, un chien, un chien, un chat, chien. Alors, ah, j'ai un chien, madame. J'ai un chien, madame. Un chien. Wait, was that supposed to be the difference between a dog and a cat? Uh huh. Okay. okay. My floppy ears versus my pointy ears. Okay, because we have dogs with pointy ears. Well, we that's true. That's true. Yes, I know Dobermans can. So <laughs> I was doing my floppy ear dog. <laughs> okay. All right. So I'm going to let you put your name up there. Put your put yourself in the right column. And if you don't, put a big old zero. <laughs> if you don't have one, or if you so, Madame J. Anchien. So, Harriet, you're going to probably put your name under Chien and you're going to put De, right? Joe, okay, bon. Joe, how many? J Eden? Do you, do, 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 Zoe and Harriet, do you know how to? All right, so that's what we're going to do next, is we're going to do a cognate activity. So I'm going to send you over to class kick. So I'm going to help our new, um, because take a look at this. Cognates are, are words that look alike in English and in French. When we read a novel, the cognates are, are easy to read because we can easily tell what they mean. Give it a try. Match the words in French and English. All right, so I am going to send you the link. Sorry. All right, here it comes to everybody. Okay. All right, so Zoe, Emerson, Jewel, Harriet, you should see in the chat a link. You should be able to click that link and it's gonna send you to this site. You'll still be able to hear me and I'm gonna be able to see your work. All you have to type in is your first name. And the story, and so we're gonna do some hand motions to help you remember. They're going to be silly, but it's to help you listen, see, get your body moving. V. This is what I'm going to do for V. Like, oh, please, I really want, please, like, oh, je veux, you know, oh, je veux une glace, I want ice cream for dinner. <laughs> je veux une pizza. 
<laughs> you put in there, je veux un chien, je veux, like, oh, please. You know, je, je, grand, I think we can, do, we'll put our hands, grand, grand, okay. Sans, they are. I was just going to put my hands out, like, they are what in the story. And so we're going to do some hand motions to help you remember. They're going to be silly, but it's to help you listen, see, get your body moving. V. This is what I'm going to do for V. Like, oh, please, I really want. Please, like, oh, je veux. You know, oh, je veux une glace. I want ice cream for dinner. <laughs> je veux une pizza. <laughs> you put in there, je veux un chien. Je veux, like, oh, please. You know, je, je. grand. I think we can, do, we'll put our hands grand. Grand. Okay, so they are. I was just gonna put my hands out, like they are what? You know, like they are, okay? Uh, il voit, that's an easy one. He sees, il voit, il voit. Petit, you can even do this, petit. <laughs> you could even do grand this way, petit, grand. All right, so in the chat here, in the chat, does Brandon want a red dog or a normal color dog? Give me an A or a B. All right, up oh, there, Emerson's got it, okay. Okay, good, you guys got it. All right, here we go, here we go. If you got it right, give yourself Six point. Six point. Give yourself six point. So, so uh, going to do a little bit of addition and subtraction today in French class if you get it wrong. <laughs> All right, everybody gets, if you got it right, six point. Does Brandon want a rat or a dog? I have a question. Yes. Message there. How many points do we give ourselves? You have six for the first one. All right. If you, if, but how do we know if we got it right? Oh, it was. Did, did I not give the answer? <laughs> oh, I'm so, I'm so sorry, Jewel <laughs> and Harriet. I'm sorry. He wants a normal color dog. B, B, for the first. Okay, B. In the second one, does Brandon want a rat or a dog? Guys. If anybody got this wrong. <laughs> sentence in French and you you are going to tell me I'll, I'll you can raise your hand and wait Eden <laughs> I thought that we were choosing which one we would want sorry okay so you raise your hand and based on us so that's we're going to practice your listening let me get my notes here okay All right So raise your hand. I'm gonna I'm gonna describe one of those. So Brandon V un chien. Brandon V un chien. Emerson? A. A or A. Uh, très bien. Jake. Jake a uh, un chien intelligent. Zoe. Wait, I can't raise my hand. What? Okay, there we go. Hi, Zoe. C. Mm-hmm. Très bien. Katie a un rat. Kate. You're gonna... Okay. So you'll go back to your e-course. Read it again. Listen to it. Okay. You see it there. Listen to to, to somebody else read it. The chapters are about four minutes, so listen to it, okay? Complete, complete the assessment. Remember, you can take it a few times, okay? You'll see something called control. You can try it, it's a little harder. You are welcome to, I've tried to give you what I, you know, one of the easier ones. 
Then you're going to use the PDF in modules and you'll complete that's called recap the chap and turn it in. What recap the chap is, is I get in you boxes. I put the most important things in the chapter and you draw what's there. Do a nice job because I'm going to be screenshotting these for an activity. <laughs> we're going to use, we're going to use those. Then you'll go ahead and complete chapter two, just the pre-reading so that you're familiar with the vocabulary. And then there's your Quizlet. Bring paper and colored pencils to class or at least have, make sure you have paper and pencils for an activity.